I never thought I'd see him again. I was. Now, I am much, much more. <laughs> it seems you are more interested in my past. <laughs> I killed Ansu out of necessity. For the crime of being a Lilithid, he would have killed me first. Mm. It's like I always told you. I was just like you. An adventurer who yearned for greatness. Nope. And now I don't believe you. I achieved it. As captain of the Wandering Eye, I acquired enough gold to found Baldur's Gate. I stayed for a while to watch my city grow. But it was not enough. I grew restless again. The sea called to me. And I ran to her with open arms. Hmm. Life at sea was not easy. Our last adventure was ruinous. My ship was destroyed. My crew lost. But my spirit was far from broken. Ah. I was determined to return in triumph once again. I heard of treasure in Moonrise. I strove to find it. What I found was an illithid colony, where I acquired a tadpole much like yours, and became a mind flayer, enthralled to the Elder Brain. It was Ansor who found me. Ansor who pulled me from the Brain's domination. Ansor who brought me home. He sought to cure me of my sickness, called on every healer he could find, nearly broke his spirit in the attempt. But he failed to understand. I wanted no healing. I was not sick. <laughs> yeah, that seems like it, right? Stelmane's death was not my fault. Really? Ansor's death was born of necessity. And make no mistake, I grieve them both. Ansor, in particular. Even after he had exhausted all possibility of reversing my condition, he still clung to hope. I tried to convince him of my reality. I was on the cusp of greatness beyond my wildest dreams. But all he could see was a mind flayer. He came to me as I slept. A mercy killing in his mind. Hey. I saw the tears. I felt his grief. I had no choice but to kill him first. It was an act of self-preservation. Hey. Put simply, yes. And being alive even more so. Do not think that I am ignorant of what I have lost. I may not regret my actions, but I do regret that they were necessary. While the past is beyond my influence, the present is not. It is time we move on. Nope. Two nether stones remain in the hands of the Chosen. We must find them before we confront the brain. Yeah, I, I, I really don't trust. I really want to do one thing. Okay. Because I really don't trust the Emperor anymore. So, what I want to do is... For this playthrough, I'm never going to use this one, basically. Uh, the Astral Tadpole, right? So, let's drop it. Life pulses from within. The Parasite's thoughts whisper at the edge of your mind. It wants to share itself with you. It wants to be let in. Go on. Don't be afraid. It only wants to help you evolve. Yep, let's do this. <laughs> Wait. Remember, it 
has enough vitality to nourish you and your allies. Commune with it. You'll see. It only wants to help you. Disappointing. You have lowered our chances of success with your actions. Uh-huh. 